Hi friends, Jeff the Rose Dude here, and in this video we're going to be talking about rose hips, how and why they're made, and when is the best time to harvest them. So let's get to it. It all starts with the flower. The flower is the reproductive part of the rose, and the only reason why it blooms is for it to create offspring. Each flower has both male and female parts, and as pollinators move through your garden, they go from flower to flower, picking up and dropping off pollen. Once a flower has been pollinated, the flower will start drying up, and at the very base of the flower is called the ovary, and that is what becomes the rose hip. On average, it takes about three to four months for seeds to fully develop and for the hips to ripen. So if you want to harvest ripe rose hips, make sure that you discontinue deadheading your roses at least three to four months before your first frost date. Once the rose seeds are fully developed, that's when the rose hip will ripen. They ripen because in nature, they want animals and the wildlife to consume the rose hips the seeds will go through the digestive system and will be dropped off at another location to where the seed can grow into a brand new plant. So how do you know when a rose hip is ripe? Let's take a look. Rose hips are ripe when they turn a bright color, usually orange or red, but sometimes some varieties can also have black or even purple rose hips. But in this variety, it is ripe and it is kind of a orangey red color. You can also tell when rose hips are ripe because when you gently squeeze them, they have, they're not super soft, but they're a little fleshy. One way I like to think about it is if you go to the grocery store and you're looking at apples, the apples are ripe. They are the color that they're supposed to be. And when you feel them, they're not going to be rock hard. They have that fleshy feel to them and rose hips are the same. So whether you're making teas or jellies or growing roses from seed, it's important for you to harvest your hips when they are ripe. Hopefully by now you're a lot more confident and comfortable knowing when to pick your rose hips. If you have any additional questions, please feel free to leave them in the comments below and I will get back to you. If you're also curious on growing roses from seed, make sure that you check out my other videos as I show how to plant roses from seed and how to grow them. Have fun with your roses.